The county of Oleśnica is located in southwestern Poland, bordering with the Wielkopolskie Wojewodship and the Opolskie Wojewodship. It is comprised of eight communes. The municipal commune of Oleśnica, the rural commune of Oleśnica, the municipal rural commune of Sitsów, the municipal rural commune of Twardogura, the municipal rural commune of Bierutów, the municipal rural commune of Inzyboże, the rural commune of Dobroszyce, the rural commune of Dziadowa Kłoda, and covers an area of over 1,000 square kilometers. The seat of the local authorities is in Oleśnica, a town of 40,000 inhabitants. The S8 national route runs through Oleśnica County. Its perfect location and the intersection of important communication routes have contributed to the establishment of new economic zones, giving employment to the inhabitants of the region. A network of schools and sports grounds, recreational areas, numerous historical monuments, cultural events, convenient transport connection to Wrocław, all these contribute to perceiving the Count of Oleśnica as a friendly place to live, work and relax in. Tourism is the second equally important branch of economy which is dynamically developing because of the county's geographical location and exceptionally clean environment. In the vicinity of Gosp, Oleśnica and Sitsów, there are eight ecological utilities and two protected complexes ranked as nature reserves. The areas protected by law constitute almost 10% of county's terrain. The European pond turtle has settled near Twardogura in Leśnestade, and one can meet such rare species of birds as the white-tailed eagle and black stork around Grabowo Wielkie. The forest arboretum situated below Stradomia Dolna is a gem of nature where one can admire an alpine rock garden, a rockery with several ponds which form an enchanting background to water plants and other protected flora. The dendrological collection includes over 1,500 species of trees and bushes. Visiting the educational path called Green School one can find out about over 60 species and varieties of pine wood. In May and June, it is worth organizing a canoeing trip from Bierutów to the outskirts of Wrocław. This 40 kilometers route leads through meadows and woods where one can come across an abundance of local birds, animals and fish. One can stop to do some camping or angling We propose several interesting cycling routes for the road biking tourists. The longest county route is 140 kilometers long. The shorter one, leading along the border of the forest, is 40 kilometers. They are all described in detail and marked. Thanks to such routes, cycling has developed in the county of Oleśnica. During the family picnics, which are organized in May, there are cycling rallies and competitors of different age groups take part in them. The building of sports halls creates favorable conditions for the development of sport. New investments enable playing important league matches and they serve the young and help to develop local sports clubs. Orliki sports grounds and tennis courts are being set up in the area. Oleśnica prides in its water park with many attractions, slides, jacuzzi, tubs and seaways. You can spend your holidays in town even when the weather is bad. Whereas on sunny days you can sunbathe on the beach by the lake in Stradomia Wierzchnia. When coming to Oleśnica County it is worth to stop over in one of the local agro farms. The Hubert farm in Twardogura can accommodate many guests. It is renowned for its tasty food and beautiful location by the water and in the midst of forests. An agro-tourism base is a suitable starting point for organizing a trip and discovering interesting historical monuments.
We start our review of historical monuments with examples of church architecture. The oldest being an early Gothic church dating back to the second half of the 18th century in Stronia, a village near Bierutów. It is the oldest surviving church in this area. The wooden church of St. Mark near Sitsuf is worth visiting. It was built in 1622. The centuries-old tradition of going on pilgrimages has given St. Mark's the name of Częstochowa of Sitsuf. The Church of the Holy Trinity and Holy Mary was built in Twardogura in 1876. It is a skeleton construction building typical for that region. Another place worth visiting is the Castle Gothic Church of St. John the Evangelist in Oleśnica. Its mortuary chapel contains the Baroque mausoleum of the Württemberg family with precious sarcophagi dating back to the late 18th century. The 1594 valuable collection of old prints, amassed by Charles II Podiebrad, the Duke of Jembice and Oleśnica, is unique in Central and Eastern Europe, as it has survived until our times in the same place. It is one of the three chain libraries in the Silesian region. The Duke's Renaissance Castle in Oleśnica is the pride of the town. It was constructed in the mid-16th century on Gothic walls. Being extended for over a hundred years, it became a four-winged castle with a tower, a barbican and a stately castle courtyard. The Renaissance Palace in Twardogura belonged to Duchess Eleonora Charlotte Württemberg, the daughter of the Marshal of France. It was erected in 1594 and then rebuilt. In 1811, the palace was surrounded by water. In front of the palace entrance gate, there is a sculpture of Hercules, transferred here from the palace in Gosht. The history of Sitsuf dates back over 700 years. Historical monuments, such as St. Peter and Paul's Church from the 15th century, or the classical Evangelical Augsburg Lutheran Church, constructed towards the end of the 18th century, reflect the affluence of the town. The four sandstone sculptures located next to the temple are allegories of the four seasons of the year. They were commissioned by the Biron family and were made in 1905 at the workshop of the Parisian artist Val d'Osnay. At that time, bronze cast sculptures symbolizing the rivers of France decorated the magnificent, scenic, English-style garden of the now non-existent palace. At present, they decorate the park in Sitsuf. Two dilapidated late Baroque-style buildings are waiting for their chance. The palace in Brzezinka, near Oleśnica, built in 1740, was once an original and magnificent palace and a beautifully created French-style garden complex with ponds and decorated with many sculptures which had been transported to Warsaw and now add to the splendor of the palace in Vilanov. The second Rococo historical monument waiting for a patron is the palace and church complex in Gosht, a village near Twardogura. Its prototype is the famous Palais Marshal in Berlin. All that remains of the old buildings is the palace entrance gate, that is the old coach house dating back to 1755. The annual harvest festival is an occasion to sum up the farmers' hard work and to present the achievements of the villages in Oleśnica County. During the festival, there is a competition held for the most beautiful harvest wreath. The performances of artistic folk groups are an essential element of the festival. All this portrays the wealth of this land. Once a year, there is a review of the artistic work performed in the county of Oleśnica. This event is called the County Cultural Presentations, during which students and alumni of schools and educational institutions from the whole county present their artistic achievements. The County of Oleśnica has a long-standing cooperation with Mesto Czernoszice in the Czech Republic. The Thursday concerts called Music Units Us 
are a permanent cultural event. They have been performed under the patronage of the Starost of Oleśnica since 2001. Professional artists participate in the performances and there are music workshops. This type of musical education is very popular.